I'm here for the gay pirates. Okay, when I heard it was gay, I thought it meant like implied attraction, longing glances, subtext, not actual gays. Holy Yes. Multiple gays. I can't believe it's not queer, babe. Steve Bonnet and Ed Teach are so in love. This show is the true meaning of be gay, do crime. The symbolism. Steed is a lighthouse. Ed Teach, my sweet, soft baby boy in leather. Your soft boy just fed his ex-bestie his own toe, but sure, okay. Tyka in leather. The ossification of black. I love Riss Darby, amazing actor, talented man. But for those of you who have seen Voltron, do you get that weird dissociation where like you're seeing Steed on screen and you turn around and suddenly it's Koran, Koran, the gorgeous man? Love this cast so much! Con O'Neill is supremely unhinged on Twitter. He's already confirmed that Izzy Hands has a daddy kink. He's retweeted Izzy Hands porn. He what? Taika, my beloved, we have gay vampires, gay pirates, and now we just need gay cowboys. I know you can do if it! I don't get season too soon. I will stab someone in the eye. I shall protect this strange, fancy little man living rent-free in my brain with all my heart. The Kraken motif with Ed is driving me insane. From all the art and stuff I've seen, I thought it would be, like, super intense and angsty and horrific, but no, it's ridiculous and hilarious and I love Did it. anyone not come out of watching this show screaming like an absolute maniac? If I hear anyone whining about historical inaccuracies or whatever, shut up! This show is basically a pirate AU fanfic. I'm living for Why it. Why is there angst now in my queer rom com? Imagine we get a beach reunion, Madagascar style. Oh, sugar honey ice. Never dude. left. And then the unscripted foot touch. Piano <laughs> music. That our flag means death is such a breath of fresh air because it balances being queer with being a rom-com so perfectly. There's two strange guys that fell in love. We love stabbing as a love language. We're fine things well. Let's run away to China together. <laughs> it's about falling in love with your best friend, sun and moon dynamics, understanding each other, and the fact they look so cute together. Guys, he made a finger for him. Rations closet. Lucius better be alive, or I swear to he God. He's such a relatable kid. He's alive and living in the walls of the ship. I am willing to join the Spanish Jackie Wife Club. Frenchie's my man. Buttons. Seagull whisper. Roach. We, John Feeney, the sweet. I just love the crew so much. Those are my babies. So your babies are a bunch of grizzled, tired, middle-aged men? Yes. Jim is awesome. I could talk for days about how they're an NB icon, but I'm just gonna go look at fans art of them in oranges right Izzy now. Izzy Hands just needs to get laid. You're a fan of Izzy? I don't like him. He's not my little meow meow or my blorbo, but I just want to look at him under a microscope, maybe poke at him a bit. We get it. You want Blackbeard to f*** you. You're a daddy's girl. You're pining, but leave Steed alone, man. The gay pirates are canon. Did I tell you the gay pirates are canon? I mean, is there really such a thing as a pirate without a little gay sprinkled Respectfully, in? Respectfully, a show about queer middle-aged pirates going on wacky wild adventures together beats out any CW teen drama anytime. I can't believe I've cried this hard over fictional characters. And these fictional characters, they're having a hard time. I hex upon you! <gasps>